drivers and guides. This is a little video clip about um, operating the electric door, which has um, turned out to be a bit controversial and it has uh, caused problems because it would not always do what you want. There are a few things to know about the door and I hope that this video will uh, help you get on with this uh, sometimes temperamental electric door. First of all, you've got your button where you operate the door. If you press the button, give it a second because the door is operated through a circuit board which is under your driver's seat and as you know electronics sometimes needs a, a second to think about what you actually ask it to do. So if you open the door, do it this way, the door will open. Make sure if you open the door that there's no bollard actually in, uh, anywhere next to your door. You can use your mirror, turn your mirror down a bit, adjust it so that you can actually see the space that is right next to the door. That The door would not swing out against the bollard. It needs about 30 centimeters to swing out and um, to, um, yeah, needs that space. Also make sure that there's no curb or anything like that too close to the lowest step um, of the vehicle. And make, basically make sure that you're not over a curb anywhere because what can happen is that if you load the vehicle with passengers and luggage and everything the vehicle goes down and then it will sit on the curb and that will bend the whole door frame. Now what happens frequently is that if the vehicle is not parked on level ground the door will play up. The door has got a safety function which makes the door stop operating or go into the opposite direction once it feels a resistance. So if you have a look at the door now, and I'll open the door and I give it some resistance and see what happens. I'll open the door and I hold it, it will stop. You will have then have to press the button to make the door operate again. If I then close the door and put my hand in between, like a passenger who, for example, doesn't take care, the door will go back if it feels some resistance. The same thing can happen if you're parked on a hill, if you're not on level ground, the door will feel its own weight as a resistance and then go back. In this case, if that happens, like everybody, the door will need some help sometimes. So what you will have to do is, the door is open, and you want to close the door, and it wouldn't do what it, you want it to do, just pull it a bit. Give it some help, pull it in so that it can actually go into the frame and then go up and lock itself. One more thing about the door then, you've seen the emergency opener on the outside, there's a counterpart on the inside, which is this handle, and it will do the same, exactly the same as the emergency door opener on the outside. Once you operate it, it will drop the door and the door will swing loose so that you can get out in case of an emergency or someone else can open the door from the outside to get you out. I will do this now, but this is not a default way of getting in or out, it's an emergency opener as it um, says on the handle. Pull this one, the door will go down and I can then push the door and it swings loose and you can get out. What you will have to do next then, in any position of the door, you need to put it back but it's locked. So there's a little button on the side that you have to press and put it back into its position until it clicks and then the door will not swing loose anymore. You can now operate the door with your electric motor, press the switch to either open it or close it and then you get out of this uh, manual mode. The round button on the outside, um, if you, you have to push it in and turn it to the right to open the door but you have to reset it to its uh, original position because otherwise you would not be able to operate the door electrically. So if you find that your door is um, not responding to your button. Make sure, if uh, make sure that the outside emergency opener is back into its default position. Otherwise, it will prevent the door from being operated electrically. Okay, that's all about the door.